we will have to do is we will have to go and block off this. And I think silver is pretty rare. And, oh crap. Whoa, I was not supposed to do that. What? What the heck? Man. Before I get into this, guys, I just want to tell you all that I make one to three or over three videos a week. These videos are new and either can be a collaboration with another YouTuber or gaming video in general. If you are at new at all, then subscribe to my channel. I appreciate a new and exciting member of the PGG Nation. Also, if you happen to enjoy a video of mine, then hit the, that like button and share that video with your family members, friends, and so on. That'll really help me out. Lastly, go and click that notification bell for new uploads every week. Now, let's get on to the video. So, for the question of the day, there are two questions by Colin, and that is the person that you guys have already seen on my channel. And I'm deciding to do to ask two questions instead of one because I felt that they are both equally important to talk about. So, yeah. So, he asks, Why are you limiting questions to your viewers? And when is your merch coming? Let's answer them one by one. For the first one, my answer would be this. My reason for limiting my limiting my questions to viewers is because of simplicity across all of my videos. Remember guys, the question of the day only takes up a very small fraction of the entire runtime of my recent upload. I don't need to answer a bunch of questions that takes up more runtime than than it needs to be. And I want to entertain you guys with my gaming commentaries. So that's why I'm limiting questions. And the, for the second one, my best answer would be this. I do not have merch at the moment, but the reason for that is my channel simply does not have enough revenue and popularity for merch to be a possibility. I want my merchandise to be done in a professional way, and that does take time, money, and people to do that stuff. But trust me, I will have it eventually. Once I get more popularity, of course. Now, if you guys have different opinions to these comments, then leave them in the comments down below. I can't wait to see what you guys have come up with. Now, let's head to the video. What's up, tech enthusiasts and gaming nerds out there? This is Gabe here, and in today's video of of MC Infinity Evolved, we actually went down into a loot-filled cave, which is awesome, by the way. And I can't wait to show you that. But first, I want to explain to you about my question of the day. You guys already saw that, of course. But I like to 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 tell you to just basically just tell your friends and family about the question of the day and also my channel because I want to make sure that I get make the best content to you guys as much as possible. And don't worry about this behind me. That's just a Christmas tree. Nothing to worry about, and soon I will move my equipment, like, upstairs or downstairs, so that's what's gonna happen. So, yeah, let's get into the video. So, we need to go and get some materials, because, of course, as you guys can see, we don't have a lot of lava here, so we may need to get more lava, and we also need resources like coal in order for us to power up this, and this is at 84,000 around that number. And, of course, I do want the magma thing, the magma crucible, which is very expensive from what I hear. But, who knows? I mean, you can get it from Netherrack, and you can, you can get it from, like, a scrap box or whatever, or use it, or, like, pulverize it with something else, so it must be okay. It honestly depends. And I know there is nether materials, but unfortunately we don't have that now. But the demonic 
thing requires something else, and we don't have much materials for the nether, so that's why we are going down to, down to mine, and I'm going to use iron materials here, so I'm going to go grab some sticks, make myself a couple of pickaxes, not a lot, but just enough so that we have this, and if you guys didn't already know, I also put uh, this thing down, the casting table, and the casting and the uh, the mold thingy that that you can use to make ingots and stuff. So that's what I've done. And later I will show you how to store this, to store items without a whole bunch of chests. And if you've already seen my Sky Factory stuff, then you guys probably already know what's going to happen. So let's go down here and let's get a, let's let's get this started. So, I would like to follow a different route here, and there is salt, which is really weird. I think this is salt. Yeah, this is salt. And I like how this uses Pam's Harvest Craft from Sky Factory. And I really like that. Pam's Craft does have a bunch of interesting stuff, and a lot of food stuff that's really helpful and beneficial. And you guys will see that, but we are not going to make one, just make, well, we're not going to make any Pam's Craft related stuff just yet. Not until we have more resources, of course, but for now, of course, we're, we're going to do something else. Now, I was, I was tempted to go here or here, but I think I'm just going to go down here and see what there is to find and don't have any torches with me. Well, that's fine because we have wood around here, so we should just go and get this. I'm so sorry, guys. I, I did not mean to do that, and I should have done that earlier, but unfortunately, I, I was a little stupid, so yeah. So this is going to take a while. I wish I had an axe, of course, but we don't have that, so... Oh well, at least we have the wood here for us to get it. And it's not the biggest deal on the world, so that's good. So, I'm probably going to get around 8, maybe? I think that's all I need, by the way. And, whoa. That's a pretty huge cave. Let's go and... Get some torches. So, I'm going to go down here. And there is lava there, so I can get that if I wanted to. But, I don't know if it's really necessary for us to get lava. But, of course we can get it. As long as we, of course, don't die from that, of course, so, yeah. And, how much coal do I have? I have 17, that's nice. So, really, what we need to do is we need to go and get myself a, lo a lava, another lava bucket. Because lava, if you guys didn't already know, the main source of fuel for the smeltery is lava. So, we can actually get up there, and I don't know how we're going to do that. We can... Use another block. I'm just gonna use sand because sand is really easy to break. I apologize, guys. That was a stupid serve sales call or whatever. But oh well, we can deal with it for now because we are going to do this. It wasn't that important to the call, anyways, so I just ignored it. And there we go. We have our lava ready and harvested. No, and I know that's going to take a little bit to to um go and go down. So we're going to just be patient, really. But we will have to go down here. And there is a lot to explore. A lot. And one of the main things I want to get down here is silver. Because in the smeltery, you can, like... You can combine silver and um, iron, or cross, well, not combine, but cross, smelt, silver, and 
and iron to make Envar. Or something like that. I don't know what it's called. But it is somewhere something where you can just... It is something that you can do. And this is a, a, a bus that we can use. And I don't know if I can pick this up. Oh, my inventory is full? Wow. Okay. And I don't know what level you're at. Oh, wait. Wrong thing. We are at level 21. Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. But we still need to get materials here. And I have a bunch of them. Including iron, which I love, by the way. Because, uh, I mean, there's like tons of iron here. There's yellow right. Um, I don't need yellow right right now. Oh, crap. But anyways, I, I, I don't really need yellow right because... Yellowite is used to make a, what is it called, a, some sort of thing or whatever, but we don't quite, we, we, we quite don't have the resources to make this, to make what we need. I can get gold, can I? Yeah. Let's get gold. And is there anything above here? There's iron, that's nice, thank you, and I almost died from that, or whatever, or just got su almost got suffocated. Let's not die, shall we? <laughs> so, yeah, not a bad start. I have almost like a full stack of iron, or, or like, I got, m well, I got more than a half a stack of iron, so. That's definitely good. I must admit. And I might as well make the rest of these torches. Because, of course, I, st I need, of course I need light, but I also need fuel and stuff and, you know, just general stuff that I may need. And if I can get up here, we can actually go and get these resources. And we are going to smelt this. This here. And as if when we get higher and higher up. Then we won't have to do as many resource mining. And there's actually a feature where you can drill down to bedrock. And get a specific ore. Or whatever. But it of course requires... A bunch of things and now this is diamond ore I need some diamonds here and we're gonna have to get that because carrot seeds I don't really care about just something in general and that's silver I want silver so what we will have to do is we will have to go and block off this and I th think silver is pretty rare and, oh crap. Whoa, I was not supposed to do that. What? What the heck? Man. Ugh. So, <laughs> we're gonna have to get the silver, of course. Because, I need silver. You don't know how many, you guys don't know how much I need silver. You guys do not. So, silver is definitely a good thing to get. And more diamonds, thank you. Thank you, thank you. We have, what, four diamonds? Awesome. And I could get more lava down here, but I'm not really thinking so. And this is level six. This is a dangerous level. We could get more redstone too. Should I get more redstone? Is that really needy? Hmm. What do I not need? I do not need salt. Because I think you can make that. Or whatever. So. We will end up. We will end up be mining the. Redstone that's underneath us. And as soon as this. As soon as we get the redstone of course. Then we can continue. And we do not unfortunately have the. Ability to mine obsidian. So we can't do that. But we will have to get out of here. 
And I know this layer, we should not be at this layer because it's where lava spawns usually, so I think I'm good. Oh, more silver. Thank you. I forgot that. Why did I forget that? You guys are probably slamming your head right now because I keep forgetting crap, but you know, it's no big deal. It's just a game. <laughs> and more silver. Oh, great. I mean, here's the problem. I, I've never really... I don't really know the texture of silver or that much. I know the texture of silver ingots because we we used it in Sky Factory 2.5, but not in ore form. I didn't know that. That's the ore form. The ore form, not order form. What, what was I saying? Okay. But... You guys can definitely tell that I'm an idiot. <laughs> so, yeah. Now, this is at level 15, so I think this is good to go. So we can just end up mining here. And this is, and this ends up in another location. Great. I love that. And more dense iron ore. Thank you very much. We need that, of course, because we need... A bunch of resources. You guys don't. You guys don't know how much I need these resources. They're pretty valuable. Ores are pretty valuable. I must admit. So, yeah, we are above a, another level, but we will, or no, we'll, we're up. We are up another block, but we will actually go, and we will mine. In this direction. And. We will get a lot of resources here. Because we're like. Digging in a straight line. It's pretty. It's pretty useful. Right? Right? Yeah. So. Oh wait. This digs. Are, this digged around. We digged around in a pattern. Wow. And. I did not mean to do that. Okay. So, we can just keep mining over here. So, what, I'm, am go what I am going to do is I'm going to speed this up for you guys. Because, of course, you guys want to, you guys probably want to see me get some or some special ores. So, we're going to do that. And then... Once I have that, I'll meet you guys back here when I'm done mining, and then we'll go back up to the surface. So guys, we're back, and 
I'm sorry, I accidentally pressed the F10 button by accident, so if you saw that like one second clip, then trust me, that's not an actual stream. I just accidentally, I just accidentally clicked that by accident because I'm an idiot, if you guys can tell. But what we do have is a loot filled fortress. Like, like seriously. We're like in the best loot filled area like ever. And you guys can definitely tell. So I may not, I may just end the video here once we're, once we go and check this out real quick. Cause this is amazing. Like, this will be a great way to end off the video. Great way. So. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get as many ores as I possibly can here. Because of course I still need redstone and I want to get rid of, well I don't want to get rid of, but I want to get more redstone. So I, I'm surprised that I have a loot filled fortress here. And I have diamonds down here, but that's really risky to get to, but... It's not a big deal. So, assuming that you guys can get to where you need to go, you guys can actually go and mine for this, for not this, but these awesome diamonds. And they dropped in the lava. Because they're idiots. So I should do instead is I should probably grab some water here or somewhere because I need to obviously go and make sure that this does not burn and I don't know where this is where water is at the moment so I'm going to have to find some here and I don't know where it is to be exact but I will find some water and there is more there's more stuff here, but we're going to have to do this. And this is another bush. Nice. So, if we go and grab this too, and if we get some of this, uh, the silver ore, then what we can do is we can go and get this stuff. But this is amazing. Like, I don't know. I don't, I don't. I don't think you guys realize how much, how much this is useful to us. Seriously, I don't, I, I don't know. I, I can't even explain how lucky I am to be in this loot filled fortress. But, we, but once we do get our resources, and of course we will end this, but let's just collect more. <laughs> uh, thank you Minecraft thank you for getting me loot that is actually useful <sighs> uh, no where is the the quote unquote bucket no no where is the quote unquote diamond pile here here it is so if we do this and if we and if we get this then we will not have to worry about getting lava melted in here so yeah that's a good sign very good sign and assuming that we get the almost the right amount of lava we can do this stuff and um, and we 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 are going to place a bucket of water down there because we will get a bucket of lava. And let's get this redstone, and then let's go and get myself some gold because why not? And we'll get also get some silver and lead because why not? 
and yeah right here here it is the clumped redstone that is so lucky so lucky Woo! that was a fun filled episode don't you guys agree <laughs> so yeah that's pretty much it guys let me head to my outro for the video and yeah <laughs> what's up tech enthusiasts and gaming nerds out there this is gabe here and in today's video of of mc infinity evolved we actually went down into a loot filled cave which is awesome by the way and I can't wait to show you that. But first, I want to explain to you about my question of the day. You guys already saw that, of course. But I'd like to, to, to tell you to just basically just tell your friends and family about the question of the day and also my channel. Because I want to make sure that I get make the best content to you guys as much as possible. And don't worry about this behind me. That's just a Christmas tree. Nothing to worry about. And soon I will move my equipment, like, upstairs or downstairs. So that's what's going to happen. So, yeah, let's get into the video.